Well, on today's program, I'm with Dr. Gavin McGregor Skinner, the Senior Director of GBAC. Gavin, thank you for joining us. So can you touch on this question? How is this variant different? We, we, we know a lot about Delta. It's been out here for about a year. What about Omicron? And that's, this is really important to focus on. We don't have the laboratory testing capabilities to test every patient, every case, and find out whether it's a Delta or an Omicron. But what we do know, the Delta variant was first detected in India in December 2020. The Omicron variant was first detected in Botswana and South Africa around about the same time, November 2021. Now, what we're seeing with the cases that we're detecting right now in our neighbourhoods, in our communities, the symptoms between Delta and Omicron are really different. So let's have a look at some of these. For Delta virus, the Delta variant, you have a loss of taste and a loss of smell, not for Omicron. With Omicron, you get excessive night sweats. Uh, people have a scratchy throat. Compared with Delta, you'll have a very sore throat. Omicron, you don't have a severe cough, you don't have a running or blocked nose. But with Omicron, you get headaches and body aches. And I, I was talking to some friends the other day that actually knew they had Omicron. And even though they didn't go to hospital, they said it still felt like they'd been hit by a truck and no one wants to be hit by a truck. So what that meant was really bad headaches, really bad body aches. But what we're seeing right now, Jeff, is that, that this speed, this speed of the Omicron variant spreading around the world but also within countries. It's just, it has outdone all the other variants. 